Hello and welcome back to Everything Gaming uh, and yes as you see in the title I'm going to show you guys how you can unlock Forza Edition cars without having to spend any credits and only using the skill points uh, in the skill perk trees for each car. Now as I'm sure you saw a couple of videos ago I showed you guys how to make a ton of money out of certain cars from the specific skill trees well the same applies here uh, just it might cost you a few more skill points but you unlock Forza Edition cars so as you can see here for example on the Nissan R390 of which I won in a wheel spin which is a very rare car in itself uh, but if you go all the way through the perks you'll see in the top right hand corner a little car in front of a gift box in which for 25 skill points I could earn the 95 Nissan Nismo GTR LM Forza Edition which is an even rarer car in itself now all of the cars I'm going to show you using the skill trees to unlock a new Forza Edition car uh, are all unlocking Forza Edition cars now a lot of the cars I did have to go and purchase in the auto, uh, auto show to actually unlock the Forza Edition car, but that's fine, it doesn't matter. Uh, a few of them I have already won from wheel spins, and I'm sure a lot of you guys will have one or two of these lying around. Um, and a lot of the time, I think we just overlook these cars and don't even bother looking in the skill tree. But let me tell you, it is definitely worth it. Uh, do not overlook these skill trees because you can see some real rarities in here. Now this is just a standard 2005 TVR Cigaris. Uh, this cost me 80,000 credits in the auto show. Now I know that's cheap and don't go and buy it from the auto auction house because people might have already used up these perks, in which case you cannot then reuse them. Uh, but from this, for what a few more uh, credits 99 all right skill points fair enough it's because it's a cheap car uh, but anyway you can unlock the tvr cigars forza edition which is another very rare car um but if you'd like i said if you don't want to use them you know you don't have to hang on to them you can sell them in the auction house there's facebook pages that you can advertise them on people will pay top buck for some of these cars obviously especially the forza edition cars uh, but if you're like me you just like to hang on to them for the sort of bragging rights just for the sake of saying you've got these Forza Edition cars. Uh, the next one I'm showing you here is the Lamborghini Miura. Uh, this car cost me about a million credits in the auto, uh, in the auto show. But from this, I unlock the Lamborghini Reventon Forza Edition. So I'm sure a lot of you have the uh, Aventador Forza Edition, which is a cool car. But even rarer is the Reventon Forza Edition car. You will not see many of these hanging around. Um, and like I said, you know, this one sort of only costs 30 skill points. There you are. So in the long run, you know, the skill points aren't really a big issue. Um, I'm sure you guys have stacked up a lot of them and got a lot of them saved up, like you saw there. I had about 360 odd skill points to begin with. <clears throat> And that's just from the past couple of days. Uh, and all of these Forza Edition cars are super, super rare ones. They are not common. You won't see many of them lying around in the auction house. And they're very, very cool. But obviously the good thing about this is you haven't got to spend a penny to unlock them. All you have to do is use your skill points to get them, which are very, very easy to come by. Even though credits are also easy to come by. This one here I didn't want to purchase because it was quite a lot. But it's the Maserati 300S, uh, which I've seen a lot of people have won in the auction, uh, in the wheel spins. You can win the Maserati. MC12 Forza Edition which is one of the very rarest cars out there. Uh, it's very cool and you can also use a skill tree to get that. I know a friend who's got that. Uh, this is a Mercedes 300 SL Coupe and with this you can win the Mercedes SL65 AMG Forza Edition which is another rare one. Like I said you won't see many of these cars hanging around uh, and if it only costs you skill points well you know it's sort of a no brainer isn't it really. Like I said, if you don't want to hang on to them, you haven't got it. You can just flog them in the auction house, make a few mil out of them. It's entirely up to yourselves. Um, now, one thing I do want to say is uh, recently I had over 345 wheel spins, some of them super, some of them normal. Uh, and I did make a video out of it. It's quite a long video, mind you. Um, but would you guys like to see that if I was to upload it? It's about 20 minutes long, but it is over 340 wheel spins. Um, if you do want to see it, just tell me and I'll upload it. It's wicked. I make a ton of money and I'm not some very, very rare cars out of it. Um, but like I said, if you do want to see that, just tell me in the comments below. Aside from that, uh, I want to say a massive thank you for everyone who's been supporting me throughout uh, and everyone who's just joined the channel. Everyone's support makes a massive, massive sort of impact on me. I love everyone's support. And as you'll see, I'll comment to everyone's comments. I'll put a reply up there. <clears throat> um, but yeah, a massive thank you for all your support. I hope this video helps you out and you get some very cool Forza Edition cars. Aside from that, all the best, guys. Take care.